All right, the uh, press plus policy issue 98. Uh, there was two questions submitted. One of them was on regards to policy 6 colon 60, which applies, it said it wasn't in the packet. That applies to K-5 districts. So that will not apply to us. And then we had deleted one word and we felt that it was better to just eliminate the word significant from the policy and just say. Um, I'd like to know why. We just, we raised the, I raised the question last time. Kristen, what is our policy? Can teachers take kids on field trips every day of the week if they feel like it? Or, I mean, if the state, if the IASB on their policy wants to put the word, you go on field trips if they're significantly enhancing the educational experience. Since we have to pay a sub, it's disrupt, you know, again, I'm sure the kids love to go on field trips, but at some point they should be in class studying too. So I, I'm concerned you don't want it in there. It makes it sound like we'll let kids go on trivial. Uh, the alternative is they can go on trivial uh, field trips. Kristen didn't have a decision on this. This was uh, myself and the oh, policy sorry. council. I'm sorry. But you, you have to approve every field trip. I and we felt that, that the definition that went on after significant that otherwise are not attainable in the class or, or in the academic course or extracurricular program. So that's why we felt that it covered it that way. Um, I, I would say too, uh, like when we talk about a field trip, it also includes extracurricular um, field trips, which only happen outside of the school day. Um, and so this is more of a broad encompassing um, policy that applies to everything. And then specifically when teachers have to request a field trip during the day, um, they have to provide a rationale as to why it is a significant um, learning experience for and students. And why it can't be covered yes. in class. A field and, trip and is and only during the day though, right? No, we use no. it. We use this definition for our extracurricular programs as well. Like the so ski it, trip in that correct. kind of thing. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. educational or, tours. Um, or if uh, a, a particular club is going off campus, uh, they have to submit it so that we know that they're going off campus and that we have a field trip permission slip on file from all of the parents. Like and we went through all of our administrative procedures okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. so that we were classifying a lot of stuff as tours. Okay. And what we wanted to do, we wanted to clean up our administrative procedures so really our tours were anything where they needed board approval for overnight 200 miles. Okay. Stuff that was above and beyond a traditional field trip or an extracurricular. Okay. So that's why we updated the policy. I recommended the updates to the policy, and then we went through and did all of our administrative procedures this summer. And you'll see those new forms uh, next month when we bring some <laughs> approvals wait. for you. And those Thank were all the only questions I received on regards to the policy. Can we get a um, resolution? Can we read it? I will. Resolved that the Board of Education, Township High School District 208, Cook County, Illinois, hereby approves IASB Press Plus Policy Issue 98 as presented in the August 14, 2018 Board Agenda Packet. Second. Any additional discussion? No? Second. Let's to the vote. Dr. King? Yes. 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 Ms. Towner? Yes. 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 